Hi Aries, this is my channel Psychic Love Tarot. Welcome to my channel. On this channel I do tarot readings for the people from all around the world in English language. So please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Right now I'm going to do a reading for Aries people that what will happen from 15th of March till 31st of March 2022. What I'm going to do is first I'm going to pull out a cross spread from this tarot deck and we'll see what will happen overall. And after that, in the same video, I'm going to pull some uh, cards for love life of Aries people uh, in the second half of March. And after that, in the same video, I'm going to pull some extra messages from the Gypsy deck. So uh, watch the video till the end so you get all the messages. And if you want to buy a personal reading with me, I do these readings on video call Skype. So if you are interested in buying a personal reading with me, you can just add me on Skype and we'll take you from there. My Skype ID is written on the screen right now. Uh, so if you want to buy a personal reading, uh, you can add me on Skype uh, through the ID written on the screen. So let's start with Tarot. Okay, messages for Aries, 15th to 31st of March. Messages for Aries, 15th to 31st of March. <clears throat> messages for Aries, 15th to 31st of March. Messages for Aries, 15th to 31st of March. Okay, Aries. One, two, three, four, and five. So the first card in the center is six of swords. So basically, Aries, right now you are in a healing kind of phase. Uh, like uh, you have been in darkness and uh, lots of troubles and all that, but now you are coming out of it. Now you are entering the light or some of you have already entered the light but I think it's still you are in the middle of this journey. And uh, for some of you, you are moving on from some situation. Uh, some of you are traveling or uh, have plans of travel or already have traveled or something like that. Uh, but basically, uh, you are in a healing phase, you are leaving something behind and you are uh, moving forward, moving on towards something new. Behind we have chariot. Okay, so uh, recently you, I don't know, maybe you got some kind of power, you realized something and you just started uh, getting your power back and you just started your life again and heading towards the success and you, uh, uh, you got some kind of determination within you and uh, you just started and you are moving forward now. Lots of travel energy for you, movement, moving energy. So uh, you are, you keep on going now and uh, you are determined now and uh, you are very strong right now and uh, you are in some kind of uh, power now. You are very strong, you are not vulnerable, you are not weak anymore. And now you want success and you are heading towards success. What's on your mind is seven of wands. So there are still challenges in the way. But you feel that these challenges, you can overcome these challenges. You have the power to overcome these challenges. Uh, you're a little bit defensive. Uh, and but you are determined to defend yourself uh, against those challenges. You are not running away from the challenges now. You are facing them and you are uh, overcoming them. Underneath we have six of cups. There is still some nostalgia which is surrounding your heart. Uh, emotional nostalgia. And uh, 
I don't know, things from past, people from past, past situations and things like that. So you're still carrying the desires and energies from the past. So that's why I was saying that you're not completely healed right now. You are in the process because still you have that nostalgia within you emotional nostalgia so it can be in your love life it can be anything else also but it's an emotional nostalgia that you are carrying with you what's coming towards you is king of cups so i guess you're gonna get over this nostalgia in the second half of march i think you're gonna complete this cycle of transition and you're gonna be achieving uh maturity and clarity especially you will be you will be uh, achieving the skill to control your emotions so you'll not be you'll be more strong you'll not be vulnerable you'll be controlling your emotions very well you'll not be expressing everything you're feeling and you'll be very careful with your emotions and you'll be mature Three cards for King of Cups. Three cards for King of Cups. Three cards for King of Cups. One, two, and three. Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords, Knight of Pentacles. So in the second half of March, you're going to be ready ready to move forward, ready to do something and you'll be uh, completely in control. There are two characters here, these two queens. So uh, don't worry about the gender. These are just about energies. Male, female, doesn't matter. Resonate it according to your situation. So uh, it tells me two things, two stories. For some of you, you're going to be having these two qualities that you'll be doing your own thing you'll be very attractive you'll be very powerful and you'll cut the situations and people out of your life which are not serving you anymore you'll be analytical but you'll be very powerful and attractive and people will be attracted to you and loving you and all that and you'll be doing your own thing some of you will be doing something creative uh, for some of you, it's like that. But for some of you, we have three characters here. So maybe these are the opportunities coming towards you. In work, in love, in different areas of your life, you are going to have options. And you're going to have opportunities, offers coming towards you. So it's a very positive energy, Aries. And I think in the second half of March, you're going to achieve some strength and some positivity and some opportunities will be coming towards you and you will be handling everything in a very mature and good manner. Now let's pull some cards for your love life. Love messages for Aries 15th to 31st of March. Love messages for Aries 15th to 31st of March. Love messages for Aries, 15th to 31st of March. Okay, Aries, one, two, three. So, in the middle, three of pentacles. So, uh, I think something already has started in your love life. It has already started for lots of you. And if it hasn't started for some of you, it will start in the second part of March. Uh, but I think it has already started and we have two threes, three of wands and three of pentacles. So for lots of you, it's a third party situation. It can be a third party situation uh, like you uh, and, and for some of you, it can be that you have more than one options in love. So you have been planning and waiting and now things are progressing, moving forward in your love life. In a very positive way uh, but you are still 
doubting the situation with this page of swords in the background. You still have some doubts in your head. And so that's why you're keeping an eye on the person or the situation, maybe checking out their social media or whatever means you are keeping an eye on them. And uh, you're still, you still have doubts. So you're analyzing. If you have one situation in love, then you are analyzing it deeply. You have some doubts. And if you have multiple options, even then you are analyzing that, okay, which option to choose, what to go, which one to go with. And then after that, we have two of wands. So it's like the world is in your hands in the second half of March, as far as your love life is concerned you will be the one to make the decision. Even if you have options, it will be in your hands. So you will be planning. I don't think that you're going to make the decision in the month of March. Maybe you will be, even if you will have options or you have options, you will be enjoying that. So it's looking very positive for you in any case, Aries. Now let's pull some extra messages from this gypsy deck. Okay, but this, uh, these extra messages, please do keep in mind that they will, they will not resonate with everybody. So if they don't resonate with you, don't worry and let it go. It's okay. Okay, uh, extra messages for Aries, 15th to 31st of March. Extra messages for Aries, 15th to 31st of March. What else for Aries 15th to 31st of March? What else for Aries 15th to 31st of March? Okay. One, two, three. So first of all, unexpected joy. So there is going to be some unexpected gain in the uh, second half of March. You're going to get something unexpected, which is going to make you really happy. But... This is just, uh, I don't know, you'll not be expecting it. So it can be in love, it can be in uh, work or anything else, but an unexpected uh, event will occur and it will make you very happy. You'll be thinking deeply about something with this thought here. You'll be deeply thinking and contemplating about something in your life in the second half of March, deep thoughts. And then after that, fortune. So throughout the month, good fortune is going to be on your side. Universe is going to uh, keep on giving you good fortune throughout the month of March. You will be very lucky throughout the month and luck will be completely on your side and you'll get abundance of lots of things so whatever is stuck will start working you're not getting anything you'll get things multiple things so lots of good fortune is gonna come for you in the second half of march so please hit the button like if you like the video and give me a thumbs up you can subscribe to my channel if you like what i do and thank you so much for watching the video Stay blessed always.